Good morning, boys and girls. It's Miss Melendez, and it's time for a story. It's story time. So I picked a really sweet story for us to read today, titled Nap Time with Theo and Bo by Jessica Shaiba. That's the author of the story. She's the person who wrote all the words that I'm going to read in this story. So what do you think this book is going to be about? Yes, you're right. I think it's going to be a story about a little boy and his dog who like to take naps together, who like to sleep together. Look at all the pictures. Someone must have taken these pictures when the little boy and his dog were sleeping. Maybe mom or dad or grandma. Nap time with Theo and Bo. Bo is sleepy. Theo is sleepy. That must be the dog's name. Maybe the dog's name is Theo. It must be nap time. He's yawning. He's yawning. Time to sleep. Time to dream. Sleeping on our backs. And on our bellies. Boys and girls, how do you like to sleep? Do you like to sleep on your back? Do you like to sleep on your belly? Theo and Bo like to sleep on their back and their belly. Closer and closer. Oh, they must really love each other. Sleeping right side up. or upside down. Boys and girls, this dog has a special name. That's called a puppy. Do you know what a puppy is? Yes, puppy is another word for baby, baby dog. This is a puppy. That means it's not a grown up dog yet. It's not a big dog yet, it's a puppy. Cheek to cheek. Oh, how sweet. And bottom to bottom. Maybe they nap together every day. Do you take naps every day? Do you take naps with a pet? Do you take naps with mom or dad? Who do you take naps with? Just right. They look so comfortable. Sleep tight. Love you, Theo. Love you, Bo. The end. Wasn't that such a sweet story? I really like this story. Boys and girls, I want to remind you that if you're feeling really tired at home or maybe you're feeling a little bit grumpy, a little bit angry, maybe you could take a nap like Theo and Bo and when you wake up, you'll feel much better and you'll have lots of energy and you'll be a, a lot more happy.